Okay. Alright, I am back. I apologize. Once again. I needed to use the bathroom. So... And it's always good to get up and, and move around a little bit and let get the, you know, blood circulation going. Move the legs. Because when you sit, like, kind of like cut off circulation to a degree. Um, that's my excuse for why I needed to use the bathroom. <laughs> Anyways, all right. So we got four minutes on this bad boy, and um, I'm wondering, like, I want to do coal. Why can't it let me do coal? I want to do coal. Because I think now that we've gotten that, I think now we can do this. And and I'm wrong. Cool. Thanks for that. Never mind. Put that away because it's noisy. Just put it like this. Okay. Uh, I'm exhausted now. Running around those beasts has uh, exhausted me, for sure. How many rotors do we have? Wow, we have over 100 rotor rotors right now. This is chugging along. Everything's fine down here. We haven't any problems. This guy, of course is not getting enough reinforced plates as always um, and this guy's not getting enough nails or screws sorry not nails and if I could make this faster I definitely would but I don't think I can so well I mean I can I guess I just gotta make an overclocker um, alright uh, do we still have those slugs on us I don't. Fantastic. Let's go ahead and overclock the screws. Maybe that'll help that process a little bit. Um, just speed up how quickly it gets made or something. I'm like, it really, it really got me. Like, God, I'm like super tired now because of doing all that running around. Um, I don't need more screws. I need a power shard. Thank you. We're gonna go overclock this bad boy. Is, is this one that we overclocked over here? Is this one still overclocked? It might be. It is. It just uses more power, which I don't think is a big issue because we're only consuming, like, I think up to 70. So we go to this screw generator. And it's feeding the rods in. It's like one to one. Is it really that slow getting the rod? Is that why it's all screwed up? Where does the other rod go? Here? Which then it leaves here and goes up there. So I actually can go like this for now. Let's, um... What's this one going to? What I should really do is... This guy should feed into here. So I think what we're going to do for the moment is... Let's just go like this. There. That'll speed these up for a bit. Because this one spits it out quick. It's just that it doesn't get in here quick enough. I think, right? Like, this guy's got the... Yeah, see, he's already got it. You can give it more power shards. It's crazy. Is it not getting ingots really quickly? What is going on with all of this? This whole process is just really out of whack. Like, it's fine. It gets it almost at the same pace. What we need to do is just... Let's just commit. Alright, let's commit to this. Now that I'm thinking about it, I can't afford it. Never mind. <laughs> Whatever. Let's go back to what we were doing. All right. Let's just go back. This guy right here is gonna get overclocked. And go, and we're gonna get you overclocked up there, pal. Kick it into high gear. Oh my gosh. <sighs> I need a day of Stardew Valley to calm down after this. <laughs> Alright, so what we need now is... We need this sped up. Where is the other one going? Oh, that's right. It goes over to this guy. Or really, I think we could just... Speeding this up isn't going to be that big of a deal. Anyways. Did the ma'am fi uh, finish? Is it all done now? Alien specimen recovered. Please choose a new specimen. Gladly. Additional samples are required for R&D to continue developing a defense-oriented blueprint. 
The creature has been named Fakacoyerus plumius cata, or fluffy-tailed hog. Fluffy-tailed hog. Nice. Let's search up the bacon. Let's do research on bacon. Now let's check our scanner. Maybe it... Maybe we can build stuff now. No, can't build anything with this. That's fine. Let's go here, I think. See anything at the bottom now? Nope. Oh, we can look at the... I keep forgetting that, that this is the hub. And that it's not upstairs anymore. So I can actually look at it on my own. Whoa! Hey! Gaterium ingots. Quick wire. Power pull mark 2. Blade runner. An exoskeleton for your lower legs that assists your movement, allowing you to sprint faster and jump higher. What? Are you for real? That's rad. I want an exoskeleton. Blade Runners, dude. Let's do it. Caterium ingots. We don't even have a Caterium thingamajig. Quick wire made from Caterium. Which then we make power pull mark twos. Interesting. All right, uh, what do we need for this uh, this hub upgrade? Because I want those I want those blade runners. Uh, 25, 25, and 100. So let's go ahead and let's just commit to it. Select the milestone. We're gonna give you all of this. So then I don't accidentally craft with it. Let's make. I think I need 100 cables. Where's our cables at? All right. Let's just let it go for a little bit. Ralph, you said you can't sleep. I, I hope everything is all right, truly. I am a little concerned, but just I hope you're, I hope you're all right, man. Um, just wanted to throw that out there. All right, so this is in. We need 25 rotors, which I can go pick up right now. Uh, rotor. Add to that stack. I'm going to turn this in, and then I just need, of course, like always, reinforced plates. So we always need a billion of those. So I, think I can just craft right here, actually. Screws. Making some screws. Oh, we don't need to do this anymore. That's all right. We can just do this. I keep forgetting that. This is awesome. Oh my god. It's so good. Oh, I love it so much. We don't need screws. Oh, it's the best. It's so good. I'm just gonna make all of them. Just use them all up. We need like tons of these plates all the dang time, so. So, we want to give the plates to this right now. So, where's that? Nope, that's not right. It's this one. Shabam! Send it up there. Shabam! Acquisition unlocked. Additional to new equipment, building, and parts utilizing basic Caterium properties. R and D insisted on inflating your pocket dimension. Got Caterium, boys, boys and girls. Got Caterium. Uh oh. Seems to be the problem. Seems to be the problem, officer. Well, that's not good. We we'll kick that sucker in out of here, huh? Something. Apparently, overclocking the screws has completely screwed me. Hilarious and unfortunate to say the least. So, we're going to have to not overclock you. How is that possible? How is that really possible? Give me this. Gosh dang it. This is a, it's a bad joke. That's what it is. It's a bad joke. Right. What is shooting us up to the moon? I don't understand. I haven't changed anything. Did we run out of fuel somewhere? Did we run out of fuel over here? Is that what's going on? 
I'm so flippin' confused. Why are we doing this? What's the deal? What's the hip haps? Are we out? No. Nope. That's a big no. I, what is wrong? I haven't overclocked anything else. What is going on? It keeps spiking up to 100 for no reason. Why is it going to 100? I don't understand. 90. 75. Alright. Let's monitor this for a minute. I don't know what is going on. 86? That's ridiculously high too. How strange. I think overclocking is what killed it for some reason. But I don't know why. I guess it just needed it. I guess it was trying to continue doing the process of overclocking. And it's like, dude, you can't. It's not. No. Uh, it's always something. Oh well. That's frustrating. But let's go over to the equipment bench. I want to make my legs. I want, to, I want my blade runners. So I need to do what I need to do to make my blade runners. There they are. Wow. So we need quick wire. We need a 50 quick wire. Bro, that might be a problem. Uh, but we got everything else. We just need the quick wire. So let's see. We need Caterium. Let's find our Caterium. Hello, kitty cat ore. Go ahead and grab these for now. Cheerio. I want to put the computers over by the MAM as well. So all the stuff that should be over by the MAM we're going to put over there. Stop having it like in a weird spot. Give me the fuel. We'll do stuff with the fuel as well. And I am so unorganized. This sucks. You um, what is that? Sam or huh? Mercer Sphere. I got like a bunch of weird name stuff, man. I don't even know what most of this stuff is or what it does. It's all new. There's like a kid just like screaming bloody murder outside too. You guys not running? Better keep running. Alright. Ugh. What a pain. What did I need? Caterium. That's what it is. Did I even grab any Caterium and put it in my bag? I did. That's all I have. Yikes. Okay. Well, let's put these computers away. Put the hard drive away. Um, power slug. You can go in here too. I'm going to put a little bit of that in here. Sam away. All the weird, like, unique stuff is what I'm throwing into here right now. I want the Caterium in with me. Is that everything? Oh, this guy. We'll put this power core in here, too, for now. I'm not going to use it. It seems to be tripping up the system. <sighs> As if that's a surprise at all. Oh, nice. Oh, we might actually, we might be able to do it. Maybe. That was crazy. Like, I don't know what was going on with my systems, man. They were all breaking down. Alright, get some quick wire made. I think I have enough now to make the legs, so I'm pretty stoked about that. I should. I wonder how high I can jump from, and I wonder if I die if I lose it now. That'd be really annoying if I do. Not gonna lie, gonna be really annoying if I do. Yeah, I can make two blade runners. I totally need that. 
All right. Let's do this. I think this goes right here. Oh! All right, let's let's check the difference. So we're gonna run the distance here, and I'm gonna count to five. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. All right, so about seven seconds. Let's see how much difference it, how different it is. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. So it's almost double. Let's check the jump. So I can jump up on the conveyor belt. We're gonna go. We're gonna do this. It's like about the top of the block. I like to do these things. All right, here we go. Check this out. Here we go. Yeah, mad hops, mad hops. Let's go on the top of a hill and jump off, and see how much. See if we take damage. That's a lot of damage. God. All right, space elevator. Thank you for that. Appreciate it. Really do. Oh, great. Cool. No, it's all good. Thank you. Thank you, space elevator. Thank you. No, thank you. No, no. Thank, thank you. Oh, that spooked me. That scared me. Woo, here we go. Yep, so it's not super great, but it's probably just a little better. <laughs> it still took damage. What a, what a waste. What a waste of my life, literally. Um, steel production. Steel ingots. Foundry. Logistics, Mark Three, nope. Um, this is what I want. I want this one. So we need 200, 200 rope, 200 cable. Um, here, we're gonna put this Caterium stuff back because I don't want to accidentally use it on something that I don't need to. So what we want now is we need, we need a ton of wire. Let's just grab that. Where is it? I need this. Okay, I want my lightsaber. That's my goal right now, lightsaber boys. All right. Oh yeah, we got mad hops now. This is sweet. Can I even see them? Oh, I can't. How are we not full? So I need a thousand five hundred, and I'm gonna have to make some wires and stuff. So we're gonna, we're just gonna call it good and go with this. Boom. Woo! Woo! Alright, that was pointless. Anyways, we want. Just throw the 10 on here. And now I need modular frames. Which means. What we can do is. Do I have reinforced plates on me? I do. Let's go like this. Cut it in half, because I'm going to need these for something, I'm sure. Make my frame. Make it for me. Come on. Come on. Sometime today, man. I, I was making myself faster. Jeez. Woo! I know. The point of it wasn't so it would, like, quick give me one quickly. Um, I just... Yeah. Anyways. Modular frames. What did I... What did I need? I need ten. I have seven on me. There we go. Got it. It's awesome around like a bunny now let's get this sent out so we can make our freaking thing go in there oh I didn't make my 200 spools uh, wow I can make a lot of cables with that that's funny how many cables do I have checking something. Wasn't sure if when I came back if I had unmuted the mic. <laughs> that is like such a worry of mine for some reason. I always worry about it. I'm sorry if it like, if you heard like an echo or something for a second. I apologize. It just always freaks me out because I've seen that happen to so many people. It's like, I hope my mic is not muted. All right, 200 of these. Bingo, bongo. 1,500 of this. 25 of these bad boys. Bingo. And kaboom. 
Boom goes the dynamite. All right, now let's Milestone see what we need to make reached. our freaking lightsaber. R&D inflated your pocket dimension and have provided an improved Xeno Zapper with increased strength and range. Nice. That's not the right thing. I smell grilled hot dogs right now. It smells super good. Xeno Basher. So I need two Xeno Zappers. I need five modular frames and 20 cables. That's like nothing, man. It's the Xeno Zappers that's the hard part. So 20 cables. Five modular frames, which I cannot make because I don't have the thing. So we're gonna go down here. Okay. What does it take to make a Xeno Zapper? Alright. You win this time. So I just need I just need cables actually, that's not that big of a deal. 20 cables. Alright. Here we go. Get ready. We're about to make, uh, we're about to make history. We're gonna make our freaking lightsaber. Here it comes. I'm so excited for this moment. More excited than I should be, that's for sure. Oh my god. That's fantastic. <gasps> yes! Oh, I love it! That's so good. Let's go find something to kill. <laughs> We're like a samurai now. Wow! Parkour. Where are you at? I know you were over here. You were chasing me earlier. Uh oh. Whoops. Oh no, we're fine. Where are they, man? I know there's gotta be. Oh, hey, look. Go figure. I don't want to kill the the good guy. He's nice to me. I know that we're looking for something to, to bash right now with our Xeno Basher, but we're not bashing the the helpful, well, not I won't say helpful. We won't bash the nice aliens. We're only going to bash the mean ones, the ones that try to kill us. What is that? Whoa. Bacon? What's shaking? Who? Where? Anybody? Down by the water again, which is a scary place to be, apparently. Oh, God, bees! I can't fight bees! It's alright, we're super fast now, so... Get away from the bees. I wonder how much biofuel we've produced now. I wonder if it's, like, a good amount or if it sucks. Like, I wonder if we've actually made, like, a lot or if we haven't. Is what I mean. These guys not respawn. I don't think they do. How come we don't have a coal plant either? Something I noticed. We don't have like, there's no nearby spot for coal yet. Was that sulfur? Is that what that said? Sulfur? Interesting. We will. Bzzz. Oh my god, that is so rad. I love it. It has a good noise too. Like, it it sounds heavy, you know? Where are you? Limestone, I don't care. I don't care about no limestone. Give me you. Alright, we're lagging again. Oh, that was close. That was really close. Just fell off that cliff. <laughs> Anyways, jeez. Alright. This is, like, super annoying me that we haven't found coal yet. I kind of want, now that we have this, I kind of want to go into that spider cave. Not going to lie. kind of do. kind of want to go into the spider cave and bash some spiders. 
kind of, I'm also like bummed out that we didn't find any of those chasing dudes because they were chasing us like crazy earlier. Now that we're so fast, oh my god, so good. I mean, like, I'm also don't want to do it because if I die and have to try to get my good stuff back, it's gonna be a pain in the butt. Pain in the arse. Pain in the arse. Oh, that was maybe a little too much. Oh no, we're good. All right, let's go check on this really quick and see how this biofuel stuff is going. I don't think it's producing anymore, so we can probably put the leaves in. Yeah, see, it's it's burnt through all of our all of our wood that we supplied it. How much do we get? Dang, that's a lot. So biofuel, fine, but we want to change this to leaves. And then we want to go and grab all these leaves. So thank you. Thanks for that. Awesome. That's a really nice list. Thanks. It'll start there we go. And it'll start doing this on its own. Biofuel. Cool. All right. So that that'll make some more with the rest of our stuff. Um, all right. So now the problem. I have still have yet to find coal. So what we're gonna do is what do we have on us? We have the scanner. That's fine. All of this is okay. Um, before we continue, let's make some bacon. Oh, let's eat some bacon. Sorry, not make some bacon. Back to full health. The basher back in. Um, we want to make sure once again that we can make we can make a miner. Five five good. Then the storage container. Good. Uh, biomass. Good, and we have some fuel on us, right? Good. All right, so we have everything we need. We're going. We're going down this time, boys and girls. We're going into the slums. We're going way down, down there. I've been wanting to do this for a while. We're doing it now. That was dumb, but we didn't actually take much damage. I would rather find coal somewhere nearby but it doesn't seem like that's gonna happen. I just think that where I planted my stuff, it's just not gonna happen. So, we're gonna go out hunting for coal again. <gasps> oh, I just saw my life flash before my eyes. Hopefully we'll find something to, to beat to death as well. Man, that sounds really gruesome. I shouldn't have said it that way. But, it's 100% my intentions. All right. Maybe we'll find something over here as well. I don't know. We were just over here like two seconds ago, though, so I doubt it. Otherwise, we would have found it. We'll find some rare ores and stuff as we're doing this. Is that limestone? Just make sure. Yep. Pure limestone. Alright. No more jumping around like a doofus. Alright. Here's our first victim. He's a big one, too. Actually, no, he's not. Dead. I killed him in three swings. Is this coal? <gasps> please. Oh, please. Yes. <laughs> oh, baby. Yes. What is this? Let's make this thing and then we'll inspect that. Oh, that's so lucky. I mean, it's not. Because it's not that close to our factory. But I don't care. I don't care. This is what we're going to do. Oh my god, we were like looking for two seconds this way. And what's funny is I walked the other direction thinking that we would find it sooner. And of course, two seconds and here it is. Alright, let's face this in the way where we have the most room. So this way is not the smart way. It's this way that we want. We want it to be over like that. Okay, so we need to build a biomass thing. Power, we need a biomass guy. We'll build this one like back here, so because it's just gonna plug like right into this guy. All right, we need uh, one of you 
right here in the mess. There we go. Can I connect one to one? I can. Do I not have wire? Oh my god. Uh, I didn't bring any cable with me. Oh boy. Luckily, I have what it takes to make it. Otherwise, this would be really sad and embarrassing. Um, no, two. Oh, that's right. Only one can connect to this at a time, huh? Crap. All right. Well, never mind. Sever that connection, please. That's why you can't do that. I, I completely forgot. All right. One to one. You to you. Okay, now we want you, sir. No power, that's what's going on here. I was like, why is this not working? Start making me some coal, sucker. Alright, what we're gonna do is we're just gonna straight up make a storage container. I wanna make a tractor. I wanna make a tractor. <laughs> Does it have to be pulled around? Nicknamed the Sugar Cube by Fix It. Pretty sweet, you know. It can be automated. Can we try it? Can we try it? Oh God! <gasps> Where'd you come? <sighs> Where'd you come from, you big idiot? Come on, you suck! I'm gonna kill you. Oh, you're so dead. Two hits. That's, oh man, he scared me. Excuse me. I'm a little busy here. Yeah. Take that. Anybody else want some? Probably attracted to the freaking noise. God, that, that scared the living bejeebus out of me. Holy goodness, that was, that was really bad. <laughs> This is way off. This isn't going to connect at all. I'm not even going to try. Just stand right in front of this. Why not? Really? Man, the game is like having a heart attack today. Holy crap. Um, storage container. Out a little ways more. Gonna be fine now, or are you gonna keep messing with me? Thank you. Feed all that coal into my storage box. Thank you. Beautiful. At least now we're we're making coal. God, that literally just made me jump out of my skin. Like I have to, I'm trying to calm down right now. <laughs> it got me really good. Uh, man, we still haven't made these. All right. Caterium. You know, the six power line connections. Ooh, okay. Coal generator. Burns coal to generate electricity for your power grid. As an input feed, so the coal can be automated. So we can literally have this feeding. How curious. Hmm. Can I build this? I can't. I can't. It's fine. But I have an interesting concept that I'm thinking of. Did I just turn the How did I turn the light off? I don't know how to turn that light on. <gasps> Clap, twirl. Nice. Yeah. Stop, please. That's really great, but I don't, I don't need that right now. <laughs> I have my light on. I'm trying to figure out how to turn the freaking light back off. There we go. It's B. God, that made me jump. Ugh. How many modular frames do we need for that generator? I'm, I'm thinking about something right now. Rotor. Dang it. Maybe make a rotor. One rotor. Right, this is my thought. This is my thought right now. Let's try something. I want to see if this works the way that I think it does. 
need this. Where does it feed in? So it feeds in over. This thing is freaking massive. Oh my lord. This is massive. That's way too close. I'm an idiot. Alright, so this is my thought. Can we get this to basically energize itself? That's my question. So we want to go like this. Two. We want to connect it to here. Okay, we can't. It's too far. Two. To here. And we want to connect these. So we need wires. I know I've gotten kind of quiet because I've been like thinking really heavily. I'm sorry. My brain is in like crazy work mode. I want to see if we can literally auto make it automate itself. Um. All right, <laughs> that's funny. We use like five or whatever, because we can get rid of the biomass thing if if it can automate itself. The problem is if it can't, I need to figure something else out. Let's see, how is this going? It's got, wow, it's got so much. That's hilarious. Oh my god. Stop at 100. How long does it last for? It really doesn't burn that much, does it? Alright, we're gonna look at this big rock over here. Oh, my back is hurting. Oh, we're gonna look at this big rock over here, and then we're gonna come back and take a peek at this coal generator, because I'm really curious about it. Because if we can get it to automate itself, then we can continue generating, whoa. We can continue to generate coal over time, and then we can just try and figure out a way to make it, like basically like a, a we can make a splitter that splits it. One goes into another storage box, one goes, oh god, where? Where are you at, you big idiot? Where are you at? Have I not seen you yet? Where are you? Don't run into my freaking machinery. They normally come in pairs, I gotta remember that. Was this the area that I died to the giant one before? Speak of the devil. Better run, dude. This is payback. Gave me three alien corp carpuses. Carapuses. Carapi. Gave me three of them. Dude, that's nuts. I don't even need to go any further. I found what I wanted. Okay, now I want to climb up this, though. That's my thing. I've been clearing these guys out because they were bugging me. But I want to climb up on this. Okay. You know, the... Um, exosuit thing reminds me of this game that we play called Valley. It, like, really lines up with that. If it, I mean, it even like feels the same to jump as that. This is like a jumping puzzle right now. I'm I'm really hopeful that it can automate itself because I would really love to basically have it so the coal power just kind of keeps powering itself, and then we have the tractor bringing coal. Oh, that super sucks. This is tough. Jump up here. Jump up here. There's a um, jump up here. Good. Jump. Oh, too far. Well, that sucks. All right, I give up. There should have been enough time for this thing to fill up on coal. Yeah. So this thing completely automates itself. Because it generates, what, 50? So what we're going to do is we're going to come over here, and we're going to go like this. What is that noise? I'm going to take this out, and we're actually going to just dismantle this guy completely. So this whole connection right here is kind of pointless, but I don't care. Um... 
Yeah. So it's still at... This is... Wow. This is nuts. This is really nuts. So this is... Here we go. This is what I'm thinking. Can I fit a splitter in here? This is what we want to do. Um, let's see. Can I even make a splitter? I don't even know. Yeah, I can. Alright. So my goal is to try and fit a splitter. Like right here, maybe? It'll be like this. Pick up all this coal. This is my this is my thought. I want to do like this. That's not gonna work. I can't place it right in front of it because it won't it won't work. I already I already know that from experience it will not do it. So we're going like this. There we go. Perfect. So now we can split it and now we can work on a way to send it back to our uh, to our own base. What we could do. <laughs> in reality is we could go like this and we can make a path that goes all the way back to our base how ridiculous would that be crouching can't afford that would be so funny I wanna do it now cause it's so stupid <laughs> oh no should I do it it would be so dumb but I love it I love the idea of this just a super long conveyor belt that just feeds coal back to us constantly. Oh my god. I'm doing it. I'm doing it. It's such a waste and it's so dumb, but I don't care. <laughs> this is going to be a pain too. It's not going to want to do it, I can already tell. Oh man, it doesn't it already doesn't want to do it. Oh no, and it's already feeding all the coal. It's alright. Cause it's all going this way because it, it doesn't have any other direction to go. Cause it's already full up on the other thing. I'm gonna I'm gonna do my da my darnest to make this work. I it's so dumb, it really is, but I don't even care. I can't afford it, that's the problem. Alright, we're going back. We're gonna route. We're gonna find a route. Let's make it go to our hub. I think that's our best plan. That's our best spot. Or shot. Dang it. And then we'll make a, probably another power generator over here that uses the coal that comes in. Oh my god, this is the best idea. This is the best, this is the best stupid idea I think I've ever come up with. I'm really excited for this. I have no idea. All right, if we want it to end here, that's our goal. Oh, we could literally have it go upstairs, but I'm not gonna. Um, we want it to end like right here, and we're gonna do like a storage container, like. <laughs> There's somebody one day who's gonna watch back on this, and they're just gonna be so triggered. They're gonna be so mad. They're just gonna be like, "Why would you do that? It's so stupid! It's such a waste!" I hope. That's my fingers crossed. That's what I want. Not because I intentionally want to tick anybody off, but just because I'd be like, yep, I did. Totally did, man. Uh, what a waste, I know. Alright, we're going to take a bunch of these. That's, I'm thinking like, probably like 600 to start. I think we have enough rods and stuff for what we're doing as well. Um, what about concrete, actually? Let's check concrete. Don't. I'm trying to open my bag. Concrete 85, I think we'll be fine. Worst case scenario, I just gotta run back. But alright, so we need a storage container right here. Alright, we're gonna we're gonna feed into like right right here. This is gonna be alright. <laughs> this is gonna be so stupid. <laughs> it's so good. Love it. Love it, I love it, I love it. I love doing dumb stuff like this. Then we won't need like anything else, because it'll just It'll just travel on over. And it will um, appease itself, too. This will just keep generating forever. I'll have an infinite stock of cop of uh, copper. Okay, so we might need to... Right here. Oh my god, is this 
idea really working. I'm kidding. Okay, this doesn't want to do it for some reason, even though it was just doing it a minute ago. Let's see how far I can get it. Okay, that's too far. I'm ruining the countryside. This is actually going a lot easier than I thought it would, just being honest. I thought this would be like a huge challenge. This is ridiculous. This is super ridiculous. What am I doing? Oh my god. Are you serious? I actually thought this was going to fail. I didn't think this was going to work. I can't... Are you for real? We did it. We have coal that brings itself all the way over to our factory. Where is it even at? Oh man, oh man. That's a lot of coal. Oh my god. Someone's been a bad boy for Christmas, huh? Look at this. And it automates itself. Generates coal very quickly, too. 120 a minute. How's the power? Is it still the same, or is it, has it had weird fluctuations? Nothing. Easy peasy. Oh, this is so good. It's so good. <laughs> so good. Yes. And it's just going to be a constant line of coal, too. Never-ending. Huge, giant line. I'm super, super happy right now. Oh, man, it's going to take, like, forever for this to get to it, though. Do I move faster than the coal? Yeah. So it's going to take a while for it to actually get there, but once it gets there, it's going to be constant. What I'm thinking about doing, and I'm probably like 90% sure I'm going to, is make a coal power plant right here. Let's see, where is it? Coal generator. I could probably make two. I mean, I, I can't make it right now, but I could make two and connect, the, connect them to the lines. I could make one right here. And then make another one like right here and connect two lines, connect, connect, and then have it go down over to this and then create my whole thing to have 200. And what we'll do is we'll have this split three ways. So then it splits into some that we save, some that goes into each one. That's a good idea. I don't know how well that's going to work though. I need to be, I need to be a little cautious because I have a feeling that it might not work as well as I'm thinking because it's going to be splitting it as it comes through, but it's going to split it three ways. Or, do we need coal to craft anything? I think it's purely, I think it's purely just a resource. So I think what we can do, actually, is just go like this. Um, before this even gets here, just break this down, break this sucker down. We're gonna move it back. We're gonna just gonna start falling off. We just start losing all the coal. It'd be hilarious. Um, storage box. I'm gonna go like this. I'm gonna go storage box right here. There we go. I'm just gonna, there you go. Look at that. How quickly does this stack up? 
three, four, five, six. Okay. This will start stocking up. This is awesome. So this is my new idea. You can go like this. We need splitter. And it's gonna go like right here. Now we need to make enough stuff to make two coal generators. I know, my whole goal mainly for this was to make the tractor, but we haven't really gotten around to that yet. Soon though, soon. Um, first, coal. Five rotors, that's easy. It's the three modular frames that's gonna be an issue. That's, I don't even think it's gonna be that much, so we need six modular frames. Six modular frames. make three frames right now. One, two, three. Need Okay, so we need a copper we need some copper spools. I think I have some stored over here. Like forty in that box. Here we go. This is what I want. You know what? We can just take all of this actually. Take all Back over here, over yonder. Um, we need a bunch of these. One, two, three. So we need. Cables. Is it 40 cables, I think? Something like that. I'm just going to let that go for a second. We'll see where we're at in a moment. Alright, that's good. Let's go and get our rotors. We just need 10 rotors, which we probably have a crazy amount over here right now. Yeah, something like that. Alright, so now... I'm going to make one coal generator. Let's see if we can make this. We might have to get rid of our path here. Which is fine. I'm gonna make one coal generator, like, like right here. I'm gonna make the other one like right here. We want to be able to. Oh, whoa! That's, that's not what I intended, but that's okay. It's okay. Did I put a coal generator in the three spot? Oh my god, you big dingus! We don't want coal generators in the three spot. We want. Bear belts in the three spot, thank you. Okay. We wanna go like this. That goes into here. This guy comes around to this one. This guy comes around to this one. Okay, let's see how this works. See how well this works, or if it doesn't work very well at all. Look at this. This guy will probably get full up first. And to reaffirm that, I'm going to go ahead and slap 80 coal into this right now. And I might grab a stack of, uh, uh, from here. Give me a stack of 100 from here. We're going to go over here and we're just going to do this right now. Okay. It's not burning any coal at the moment. I'd like it to get full and have it do a full stop. Because I want these things to be, like, these are my, my um, emergency ones. I want them to be 100% going, no problem, all the time. Alright, so let's now... I'm going to go like this. Do... Two... Actually, we're going to go like this. One... comes. There you go. Our power making should now have gone to 200. Let's see. Nice. Yes. Fantastic. 
Alright, so let's... Ah, so good. Alright, let's see how much it's burning. Let's see if it is burning or and if we might have any issues. It's, like, it's burning, of course, but it's not, like, burning through them. It's still really slow. I mean, it's gonna be nothing. This is fantastic. It's still gonna be stockpiling in here. We'll probably have this whole thing just completely full. This is the best. Oh, my God. Ah, oh, this is working out so well now. Once you get coal, it's like... I almost don't even have a need for these at all. Two coal power plants, like, already max my stuff out. Let's go grab that um, power supply or whatever. That's what we want. We want this. And we're going to go plug it back into the screw maker. And get that amped up. Yes, you. You at 200%. We're going to see how it affects all my stuff. And now, the other thing we need is... What did we need at 200%? This guy, I think. Is this what we need? We need this at 200%. Yeah, because it needs to spit them out faster. So we need another slug. Give me a slug. One slug. We might as well just grab them both. Just turn them into freaking things right now. Actually, make three. Apparently, I had a slug on me and I didn't know about it. Okay. Now, we're gonna go over here. What we want is you. You need to be overclocked. Because you're actually not producing fast enough for us. So, overclock this guy. And what we want is. You, we want a mega conveyor belt right here. Right here. Double time all of that. I was gonna I was thinking about making a ton of like the reinforced plates and double timing my entire coal thing, but I don't actually think I need that. So I don't it's not really a big worry. There we go. This one's already overclocked. It should be spitting out a lot faster. So this should be piling up now. That's how this should be going. Yeah, so it's it's getting one once again at the same time as it's getting done. It's generating a lot faster. I think it's fit generating so fast that it's piling up in here. Which I think is a good thing. Good. Now we're actually starting to get places. So I've already still got this doing the reinforced plate, so I'm not going to stop it now. This takes a long time. We should probably overclock this guy. At least when it starts... If it starts to get a big pile of screws going, then we'll overclock it. But until it has more screws than it can handle, I'm not going to do it because there's no point. But let's let's look at our power consumption right now. Like the 64s, it's going to have a big spike at some point. So we're at 70, 75, 79. Probably hits about 100 right now, I would I would think. It, hit, it went up really high when we, like, kicked the, kicked the overclock into gear. Oh, plates are piling up. That's a good sign. At least one of them's piling up. I want to see the freaking screws pile up. Alright, let's see. Can we do... Mark II conveyor belt right here. Probably gonna push them faster than it can even come through, but that's fine. This is already in one too. Yeah, it's like pushing them out faster than it can even feed them in. But once again, not a problem. And this is over here making rotors. Alright, is this a problem? like not getting enough rods quick enough. That's getting right at the same pace, roughly. Okay. We don't have any that are going into this right... Oh, no. Into this right now. And it doesn't... This one over here, using it for the reinforced plates, don't you? It doesn't use that many. But my problem is, I'm worried that it's gonna come to a point where it, uh... I run out and I don't realize it, so I want to reconnect that line. So we're gonna we're gonna go ahead and do that so I don't forget. 
I know it's just going to cause some problems, but it's I just think it's the best bet right now. Might end up double overclocking this one. This is the thing that's like keeping us a little bit. Yeah, that's the problem. Hmm. Do we have another overclock thing with us? Or did I plug it in somewhere? I think I plugged it in. No, I've got. Wow, I've got two more with me. That's so what we're gonna do. We're gonna double overclock this guy. Now that it's getting enough iron, I think that we can do it and it'll be successful. Pick it up. There we go, that's a lot faster. That should hopefully make up for the uh for the difference. We're really just doing upgrades right now. Get it in there as quick as possible. Good. It looks like it did just about make up for the difference. Uh oh. See, this is all stuff. Okay, so when the one goes in, that's when it slows it down for a second. Because this is all cut off, so it's only going back and forth between these two. I think what we're going to do is I want to come over here I'm going to grab this. I want perfect. That's exactly what I was hoping. We're going to fill this one over here with these rods. So then it stops pumping into this. I want it to only keep filling this if it needs it. Not just keep filling it all the time. Basically I just want this to have like if I need some rods I can go grab it and it will keep storing them. But I would really rather it just feed straight into uh, the main guy. That's kind of like where I'm at with that. Why does it keep... Oh, it's using a couple. That's why. That's weird. Okay, so we're going to put this in here. We're going to put this in here. We want to... I'm trying to fill this up. I want it to basically keep feeding more into it, but just... I want it to cut off and then pile up. Because then it won't feed any more to it. with some machinery. Alright, so here we go. This one in here. This one in here. Good, there we go. This is perfect. That's exactly what I what is needed right now. Just fill this all the way up. There. So this is full. So this should start like piling up. That's what we want. Maybe, how about we do this? Can I go like this? Just go over here. There. Feed in like a bunch into the system. That's what I want. Perfect. So that's blocked off. This is going to start stocking up really fast. Perfect. You would think that that's not what I want, but I, I do want that. I want these to continue to get what they need, but slowly so it's not holding back our screw maker. Perfect. We're golden now. We're golden. We're all set in this department. Go keep pushing them out. There's none in here, which is fine. And so we keep pumping it out over here. What I would love to do is to get make like a ton of screws. I don't have any freaking poles, do I? I'd love to just get like a ton of screws and fill this up so then it back and it starts stockpiling up. And then How many do we have? I don't I don't have like any over here, do I? No, not really. That's fine though. We did it. We did a bunch. We did really good. This is this is fantastic. This has been a very productive um, set. So we need let's go ahead and make this tractor, because I really want to make it. So we need two modular frames. And we need five beacons. Let's go over and see beacons and see what we need for those. It's really weird. I wonder if this thing's actually like a tiny little go-kart thing. <laughs> I have a feeling that's what it is. Oh my god. Um, I thought it was a car. Like, I thought we were going to get a car. I need five rods. That's really all I need. 
Five rods. Of course. Now, let's see if I have any in these boxes. Hey, I have like a couple hundred in this box. That is nuts. Why this stuff just sitting here? Go on the waste. Uh, I need five beacons. One, two, three, four, five. Right, by five. Consumable used to mark areas of interest displayed on your compass with the color and name you set. Man, I should really have been using that. <laughs> but oh well. I haven't really had anything that I wanted to save yet for like locations. So I don't think it's that big of a deal. Uh, power shower. Can we make one more? Oh no, it just makes one. So there's probably a way to make multiple. Uh, cable. What did I need? Oh, modular frames. I actually, I actually need just two. Perfect. I think. Right? <gasps> it's adorable. Look at this. Oh man. Can we drive it? Please. Can we please drive it? Let me drive it. <sighs> no. I need fuel. Is this coal? I have coal. Coal in the fuel tank? Maybe? What, what does this do? I want to drive it though. I don't want to. <gasps> yes! Oh! We're doing donuts! This is the best. Can we run into something and break it? I want to know. I don't want to hurt my car, but... Okay, so no, we don't break things by running into them. This is fantastic. So what you can do is you can have this... Um, you can set up like a delivery route. I think we ran out of coal already. <laughs> we did. Ah, that is fantastic, man. I want to drive it off a cliff. <laughs> of course. Of course, the first thing I want to do is like destroy it. I get it. You're out of freaking stuff. That's fine. Oh my god. That is just super. I love it. We need to park it somewhere where we can actually let... Oh, here we go. We'll park it over here. We're gonna park it right here. Um, this is what I want. I want Q. Tractor. Tractor. Yay! <laughs> we have a car! We have our very own car. We don't have to... I think running is actually faster, though, funny enough. <laughs> Just pretty sure that running is faster. Oh, wow, this is already almost full. Coal just, it's so easy. Once you get the coal, man, it's just so easy. I love it. I really do. We're going to end up having to make a third coal plant just to use up some coal. This is good. This is really good. Not a complaint at all. We made our tractor. Uh, we should probably get something researching while I'm thinking about it. Um, bacon, whatever, please choose. Okay, so we can now probably search up bacon. Amanita lardum or bacon agaric can be added to the object scanner catalog after unlocking the new blueprint in hub tier 1. Hub tier 1 for bacon, huh? Wow. Wow, bacon. We can do another one of these? Ten? What's the point? Did we gain anything new last time we did it? I'm like, I want like armor. Like, I want defense, man. Um, we could do the yellow power slug, which is higher than the green one. Hard drive. Let's just do this. Let's do this one. I've got these on me. Bam. That's gonna be for a while. But that's okay. Alright. Well. Let's check out the hub really quick. See, we have this new tier, a new mushroom. Mushroom. Oh, I guess I guess the bacon technically is a mushroom. Here, send it up. It should be like two seconds that it flies back. Did it even do anything? I don't even think it like had a timer. I think it literally just added it right away. <laughs> That's funny. Okay, so the problem that we have now is I need steel produce production. Which means 10 modular frames, 400 or 200 of this. We're, we're doing this. Let's just do this guy. So I'm pretty sure I can finish all of this right now. Um, we want to go 1,000 of these. 
We need 200 cables. So let's see if I can just make the 200 cables right now. It's gonna be a close one. Nope, I'm not gonna be able to make it to 200. That's fine. I'll go over and grab some more of what I need. Um, 10 modular frames and 50 rotors. I have 31 rotors right now. Um, can I make any modular frames? I don't think I can make any at the moment. Because I can't make any reinforced plates. Um, let's go down really quick. Modular frame. Yeah, and this only makes one. Yeah, it only makes one. So, it'd be better to do this. How many did I need? Ten? Ten mod modular frames? Okay. We're gonna get this hub one, this next one going. Um, let's see. We need a, let's just go get a ton of spools. Alright. My other thought, too, was just give me all of these. This is my other thought. Um, conveyor belt mark two for this. What does it take to do that? A lot. Yeah, so it'll take a few of these. We have another iron spot too that we can use. It's kind of just sitting there. Um, what did I need for that? Oh, yeah. I grabbed all the spools, so I'm gonna take... I'm gonna make a ton of these. I'm gonna make a big old bunch of these guys. And we'll upgrade that spool thing so maybe we can fill that box. If we can get that filled, um, we can, we can start making some changes. We can have, like, a reinforced, reinforced plate generator thing that just generates for us. We can set up a whole nother thing, actually. I didn't even think about it. We can set up using that other iron spot. We can set up a reinforced stitched iron plate crafting thing just to sit there and keep making it for us. Okay, so modular frames. What are we at right now? Oh, we're at zero. That sucks. <laughs> I didn't realize we were at zero. Okay, so the, we got those. We got pretty much everything now, I think. Oh, I need cables. Cables up to what a hundred? How come our cables went? Oh, we we need two hundred cables. All right, finish this one up, and then that's probably going to be it for today. Got French dip to make. Uh, we need rotors. All right, we need a stack of rotors. Slap it in there. Beautiful. Beautiful. Just want you to know. My favorite girl. Um, that's right. I forgot for a second what I was doing. So you go in here. You go in here. You. Three, two, one. Lift off, baby. We got steel production. Milestone reached. Getting up there. Steel production unlocked. Yikes. Foundry and improved miner included to ensure efficiency of new pipelines. A collection of new, more complex parts is now available for crafting. Well, so two resources into alloy ingots. Alright, so we got that. Do we have any new vehicle stuff? No. Organization? Uh, nope. Walls? Nada. Foundation? No. That's not what I wanted. Logistics? Nothing. Power? Nothing. It's all in here. It's, it's all this. So now we can make like steel beams and stuff, which means down here, yeah, steel beam takes three steel ingots. A steel ingot takes three iron ores and three coal. Oh, it does take coal to craft. No! Dang it! Oh, man. That's gonna be tricky. What's a stator? Stator is steel pipes and that. I don't know what the point of that is, but we'll figure it out. This needs rotors and stators. Stators need steel pipes and these. And steel pipes just need steel ingots, which steel ingots needs this. Oh my 
god, we have so much more to do now. Oh boy. Well, this is gonna definitely get a lot more tricky as time goes by. But for now, let's make some reinforced plates. We're gonna go upgrade our coils right now and then probably end it because we're gonna need those to start piling up a lot faster. Because right now the rate at which they're piling up is oh crap. Why? What is the problem? Did we run out? Is that what happened? Son of a gun. Alright. Well. It's okay. Hey look, that's funny. It still works. Come up here and get some biofuel. We're gonna definitely need another coal plant. So we need five of these. Two, three, four, and a three. That's fine. Not a big deal, but we'll we'll probably start harnessing our coal a little more soon. Uh oh, that was bad. Okay, we're good. Um, let's see, two hundred. Two hundred. Two hundred. Wow. So it's a couple. It went for a couple hours, and then it finally wore out. Two hundred over here. Yeah, if I had another coal plant, I could probably have... I could have... Those have, could have probably died and it wouldn't have mattered. I wonder if you can slap coal into these or if it's biomass only. Um, let's see. Alright, let's crack it up. There we go. Perfect. Yeah, so we're over 100 for sure. Good to know. Well, we'll figure that out probably next time. As long as this can keep running, that's all that matters. But we'll figure all of that, out, that mess out next time. Because right now, as it stands, not 100% super important. Um, at least not at the moment. Not to worry about, at least. Okay, so let's upgrade this. So then we can call it quits for today. go so this is all sped up now problem is it's going faster than uh, it can produce which is interesting to say the least but that's all right because it just means that it's just gonna get in there faster it's not changing how many we're getting just changing how quickly it loads up so which we're gonna need that because I took all of it out but that is gonna be it for today guys we're gonna go ahead and go back up to our house our house on the freaking on the rise I'm so curious about this first off turn you off because there's nothing no reason for you to be running um, I'm so curious about if I could put coal into these and if that'll still work or you know different stuff like that I'm just I'm getting more into it but it's also like everything is getting trickier the longer that we go um, which is not a bad thing it's, it's good but it's gonna be just means it's going to become more of a struggle to make everything fit and make everything work the way it's supposed to. Um, which is, I guess, is exciting in its own ways. Um, but anyways. That is going to... See, look, we got like a perfect view of, of like just about everything right here. It's like, just like, go like right there. Perfect. Alright. That is going to be... <laughs> that is going to be it for today. I'm happy with the progress that we made. We made the tractor, we got coal... We have the coal almost to the point where we are fully stockpiled on it, which is absolutely just insane. Um, what we'll probably have to do is split that coal line multiple ways and have it be that, like, maybe we have a second line that comes into our factory somehow to feed into making steel beams and stuff, but I, I don't know. For now, we're doing fine at the moment, but either way. That is going to be where we stop for today, guys. Thank you so much for joining me. Um, if you want to watch back through all this stuff, you can do so. YouTube.com slash MrBagels. Uh, or watch live. Twitch.tv slash MrBagels. I keep saying that at the end of the streams and the stream VODs and stuff. Just because I have a, a bad tendency of like not 
uh, what is it like networking or whatever I have a tendency of just not saying any of that stuff and just letting it go and I, f I feel like it's probably just helpful if I mention it every once in a while but either way that is it guys thank you for joining me I hope you will join me next time I am Mr. Bagels goodbye <laughs>